Hey guys, Tini here. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to overdraw your lip to make them appear bigger. So if you want to learn this technique, make sure you keep watching and I'll show you how. To start off, I'm going to grab my MAC lip liner pencil in Hover and I'm going to use that to line my lips. Now to make my lips appear bigger, I'm going to overdraw the edges of my lips and really focus on bringing out those sides. That way it looks more natural. I'm going to start off by lining my lower lip and following the natural shape. Then I'm slowly going to bring that edge out so I'm overdrawing that lower lip just a tiny bit. When you're doing this on yourself, you want to make sure you just overdraw a little bit and not too much because then it'll start to look very obvious. Then I'm going to do the same with my top lip. So again, I'm just going to follow the natural shape and then slowly bring out those edges to make it appear fuller. If you're finding it hard to draw a smooth line, just smile so the skin stretches out, which helps your liner glide on smoother. Next, I'm just going to quickly fill in the rest of my lip and making sure I don't forget the corners as well. Then I'm going to grab my Kat Von D Everlasting Love Liquid Lipstick in Lolita. Oh, that was a tongue twister. <laughs> Now, I've worn this in some of my other videos and you guys have constantly asked me, so this is what I've been wearing. Um, you can get it at Sephora and it's a very long-lasting lip stain, so make sure you don't try it on the back of your hand because it'll stain. Now I'm going to grab my MAC Viva Glam Gaga 2 Lip Glass and I'm just going to apply that to the center of my lips. Now because this lip gloss colour is much lighter than my lipstick colour, it's going to create a little gradient effect which will help make my lips appear fuller. To finish off the look, I'm going to grab my MAC 212 brush and my MAC NC30 concealer just to clean up the edges around the lip. Using the flat part of my brush, I'm just going to outline the edges of my lips. This will help clean up and help define the shape of my lips. And this is the final look. Now let me show you guys the before and after photos so you can see the difference. So I hope you guys can apply this technique to some of your future makeup looks and, you know, create that Angelina Jolie lip so, you know, you can fake it till you make it. Anyways, let me know in the comment box below what other videos you want me to make. I am working on a couple of different videos, um, so you have to stay tuned for that. In the meantime, make sure you check out some of my other um, tutorials, one how to fill your eyebrows, how to contour your nose, there's lots of them, so check out my channel. And you know the drill, make sure you like, share and subscribe to stay updated with future videos and I guess I'll speak to you guys next time. Bye.